What's up everybody? It's Captain Brad with Choctatchee Bay Fishing Charters. I haven't made a video in a long time. I've just been really busy and just really haven't had the time. So here we are making you a video. So <clears throat> this morning I'm headed out to look for our big bull red fish school. Um, every time the temperature starts to drop every single year, um, the bull reds come in the bay um, to feed on all the bait fish uh, before winter gets here. They try to fatten up before the winter time. So um, further into the winter you get and the bigger and fatter these bull reds are going to get. So anyway, I'm going out today to search for that school. Y'all hang with me. Let's see if we can find them. Hey guys, it's probably pretty windy, but I believe I found the bull reds. Stay tuned. Bull reds go, baby. Yes, sir. Right in front of the airport. Look at them. God almighty. All right, guys, so I'm pretty much surrounded by bull reds right now. Um, I'll zoom in. Uh, you probably see some way off in the distance blowing up. Uh, let's see if they pop back up for me. Uh, oh, no, that was a dolphin there. Surrounded by bull reds and dolphins. You see the birds working way out there. Come on, bulls, pop back up for me, baby. You guys probably can't see them, but I can see red backs right underneath the water. I do see a school over here on my right side on the surface, but they were just blowing up right here. The tide's changing right now, so I was out here way earlier, like two to three hours ago, and I seen them blow up one time, and it was like dead. So now the tide's changing. The tide's just gonna start coming in. And they just started feeding again, literally like five minutes ago. So while I'm waiting on the bull reds to pop back up, I found them. They started feeding. It was like two acres just spread out of just bull red fish. And I tried to get close enough to get a cast on them, but I was just, you know, wanted to get more video and just watch what, you know, watch which way they were moving and whatnot. And so anyway, I'm just sitting here on, it's hard for you guys to see, but there's a, there's a tide line like right in here and it's um you might be able to see it like right over in here uh i'm literally spot locked down on this tide line there's a pontoon boat over there um they've been out here and they the redfish actually blew up right underneath them and they were like they didn't really know what to do i went over there and was talking to them about it and it was just an older couple and they were like well we didn't really know what to do we weren't ready for that and i was like man you, i mean when it happens you got to be ready you know but uh anyway i'm sitting here with two finger mullet live finger mullet free lined out while i'm waiting and uh i'm hoping that it, they start feeding uh more often because now the tide's swapping um right now we're kind of at a slack tide uh <clears throat> changes right around 155 today i think and i'm pretty sure it's about two o'clock so um as soon as this tide starts coming in i bet they fire back up so i'm gonna sit here and wait with these live baits and see what happens stand by y'all i'm blowing up up there boys there he is boys we got him Got him on. Let's go, baby. Big old bull red, y'all. <coughs> Just had a sports fisher run right over the whole school. That ain't gonna be good. You can probably see the waves in front of the boat from the guy. I was right here in the middle of a big school. He ran right through them. That's all right. 
They'll be back. Using a 5000 series Shimano Stratic, 30 pound Power Pro, 30 pound fluorocarbon leader, and a Storm Swim Bait. This is a freaking monster redfish, y'all. Right, here he comes, y'all. We get him. It's freaking huge. She's huge. Check it out, y'all. Go, oh, baby. Look at him. Oh, that's awesome. There's another school over there. Holy crap, look at that. Big school of blue reds. Another big school over there. There's actually a little school right there. Check this out. Oh my gosh. Let's go, baby. I caught one. I'm not gonna mess with them too much more. I just wanna come out and make you guys a video. Uh, but this is what you look for. You come out, throw you a swim bait like that guy. Don't run right up in the middle of the school. Stay back and cast into them. Nothing better. Just bull reds everywhere. Let's go. Destin Bridge. Go, baby. All right, I caught my bull red that I was after. Um, I showed you guys what the school looks like. Um, I give you the whole rundown. So I hope you guys get out here and get on the bull reds and enjoy it like we do. This is probably the hardest fighting fish we have in the bay on light, you know, on light tackle. I have the Jack Crevel gives him a run for his money, but it's uh, nothing like fishing these big, huge bull red schools. Anyway, I'm headed back in. We'll see you on the next one.